Hello everybody, so in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to download and install data packs for Minecraft Java using the modern app. So, let's get started. The first thing you wanna do is make sure you have the modern app. If you don't have it, you can go to your web browser and from there, I will have links in the description if you need them, or you can go to your search bar and search up for mod Rinth, like so. Once you entered, you should see modern.com here, just click on modern here, and this will bring you to the modern homepage. Now, you can go to the top of the website to get modern app, you can click the button, and then you'll see an option to download the modern app. Okay, so once you have the app, you can go ahead and close your web browser, you can install the app, and then it should show up like this. So all you want to do here is click to open the modern app, and then you will have an interface like so. So all you want to do here is log into your Minecraft Java account on the top right corner here. And once you did this, you will be able to go to the left corner to discover content. Now, what you have to do is go to data packs here. And then you will be able to download some data packs. So for example, if we want Terralift here, all you want to do is click the box for Terralift. It will bring you to this page. And then you want to go to versions. From there, you want to go to platform and select data pack. And then all you want to do here is simply go ahead and download the version that you want. So for example, if we want the latest version of Terralift, we'll just go to the download button, it will become green. And then you want to do install. Now you can search for an instance, but as we don't have any, we'll just do create new instance. And then from there, you can give it a name. It can be anything, so I'll call it name. And from there, you can do create. And now it is creating the new instance for us. So it now brought us to this page here. And all you want to do from there is simply click play. So you want to click play here. And then it will download all the required folders and files and also open up Minecraft for us. So here is Minecraft. And all you want to do here Press enter to enable the narrator. is simply set your settings. This will reset your settings. So that's one thing to note. So we'll just do simple settings here. And once you're done with your settings, all you want to do is simply go to single player here. You want to go to single player world. And from there, you can set some settings, give it a name. And the most important part here is to go to more. And then you want to click data packs. From there, you actually want to do open pack folder. And from there, you actually want to go to the modern app, like so. And then you want to click the three dots next to the name of the pack here. And then it will show you something called show file. And here is where our file is downloaded. So all you want to do here is copy it. Then you want to go back to your other profile, which is MC world here, the temp one, you want to click paste and now you're done. So we open up the modern file. We copied it to the temp MC world here, which is our Minecraft world. And from there we see Terralift. So all you want to do here is just click play. It'll bring it here and then you want to do done. And now all you want to do is create world. It will tell you these are experimental features, of course. So do yes. And then you can wait for Minecraft to open up and then this is how we're gonna get data packs to work. And this is Terralift, so we can see different terrain generation here from the normal Minecraft. So we do know that Terralift did work. So yeah, that is how we get data packs working on Modwin. So if you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one. Bye.